<laughs> like it literally skipped my mind. Like what? <laughs> Hi guys. Hi guys! Welcome back to another video. I am Ravelin Dindi. This is Lenny Precious Sihume, the Precious Gem on Instagram, if you don't know. <laughs> no, no. So guys, we decided to make a collab on this video to speak about conversations from different perspectives. Yes, and of course, we're featuring each other on this video and this will touch base on cultures, everything that you can think of that people don't normally make it a norm to talk about. So yeah. we'll be touching on such things. And while we start on that, I am a vendor girl and she is Swana. So that's the reason why we decided to make this video on different things that, you know, we don't usually talk about. We will be talking about them on this video. Yes, different perspectives from different backgrounds. Yes, exactly. <laughs> and I really hope that you guys like this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel or her channel, what are you waiting for? I mean, what are they waiting for? <laughs> <laughs> um, so we won't just be talking. And I love food. I don't know about you, guys. I love food. G girl, food is food is bae. Food is bae. Food doesn't know. disappoint you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll just uh, we'll just show them what we're having here. Yeah. Okay, we have chicken licking wings. Oh my god, those wings are a lot. But okay. No. Like, and we have some fish and um, prawns. Yeah, that's for her. Not for me. <laughs> she doesn't like this. And then we have chicken nuggets from McDonald's with jalapeno sauce. So Ooh, we'll just and be... And of course we're drinking on some please look them up. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So for that, there we go. McFee's watermelon from McDonald's. Yeah. It's the plow, guys. It's the plow. If you don't like McDonald's, then I don't know what. But what do you what What do you like if you don't like McDonald's? You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone likes McDonald's. Yeah. Okay, guys. So we'll just start with the conversation. Mm -hmm. I think we yeah, should. Yeah, be here. Girl, listen, mm -hmm. and we have the sauce, <laughs> guys. Okay, I think I'm gonna get sick after this today, but I don't care because this is like hot wings. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Babes, do you still remember the one time we had a conversation about? Like the beauty thing with the stereotypes with mm -hmm. the pompo people and all that. Mm -hmm. I think we should talk about that one. Yeah. yeah. Because um from a vendor person, I've always received like nasty comments from people telling me, You're too pretty to be vendor. Are you sure you're vendor? Are you not what 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 what? And of course, um I also had a vendor friend whom I was like, Girl, you too pretty to be vendor. Mm -hmm. So I know what she's talking about and how she, I'm one of those people who would be telling um vendor people their thing so i really know how it feels and mm. i would like as a um a victim of that thing i would put it out there Jorge, it's not it's not okay i mean why would you wanna say that certain people have to look certain way yeah what who's who gave you that memo i want to know about yeah. the memo <laughs> i feel like it's, it's just a stereotype you know there's usually stereotypes that comes with different tribes yeah like zulu people are like this when the people are like this yeah. and i feel like that's not okay especially when it comes to looks also exactly oh can i tell you also something um the people think that Tswana people are light skinned mm. and when i tell them that i'm Tswana, they're mm -hmm. like girl but you're not light skinned mm. okay, but home so what should i do to myself this puts something in, okay. in you while we're still on that, I am guilty for that because I used to think some of people are really light skinned as well. Really? Yeah. Because I've met <laughs> a lot of partners that are like really, really, really light skinned. Light -skinned. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Elena, I actually do know a lot of Tana girls who are light skinned, mm -hmm. but also now I'm there to I remember. I call another dark skinned ones, which mm -hmm. is not a problem. Yeah. But we just need, need to let society know that you can't associate a certain color or certain body type to a certain yeah, or culture. Yeah, or beauty standard. Yeah, or beauty yeah, standard to, to a certain, certain culture, yeah. Because mm. even me, like, I, 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 I know, I know what I'm talking about. I receive it a lot, especially sometimes even when I have my natural hair on because my natural hair is like it's this super, big. God, you haven't, you should go to her, uh, her uh, Instagram hair. Please do, yeah. No. My hair is amazing. No. People don't even believe. Okay, it's, it's cool, you know, you get people saying, no, you don't look Venda, you don't look whatsoever. Mm. When I have my natural hair, it's even worse. Are you South African? Are you sure you're from SA? Imagine now they're taking it abroad now. Exactly. It's no longer in it. <laughs> and I feel like that's really a problem because what you're saying, are you saying that uh is this thing especially for example if you have like different color eyes mm. people would say no you're wearing contact lenses and if you're not, they would say, Are you mixed? And I feel like it's a problem because mm. now we want 
a certain thing has to, to be associated to with yeah. exactly mm -hmm. you have to be mixed for you to be beautiful you have to be mixed for you to have beautiful hair or to have i, I don't know it's, it's really it's, a problem it's, it's really a problem guys i'm, I'm in food i'm within food i'm mm -hmm. sorry <laughs> so yeah it gets it gets to a point where you just don't know mm. if, how to feel about it because it's just overwhelming because yeah sometimes you would feel bad sometimes you'd feel like okay maybe this is a compliment but you really don't know how to take everything you know yeah and it's really not a compliment don't go mm -hmm. around telling people that you don't look Tana, you don't look venda you don't look whatsoever people can look however they want to look babes you make me mm -hmm. feel so short <laughs> <laughs> <Bro. laughs> but yeah guys you know mm -hmm. those are like one of the things and let me tell you something i know you don't know this mm -hmm. but you will know now <laughs> just like everybody else was watching mm -hmm. i didn't like how Mm. Let me tell you why. I know why. <laughs> why? <laughs> you remember we had a conversation? Yeah. And the conversation was heated up. Mm -hmm. You know why? Because I still had that mentality. So now, it's good that I'm the one coming forth mm. to tell the other people who are still having that mentality. Yeah. Stop. It's not cute. Yeah, guys, it was really it's not nice. Not I, I, cute. I was like, this guy who does. I, I think I deleted, I deleted your numbers. <laughs> 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 I was so mad at you guys. It happened it happened the day that Miss South Africa won. Like she do one for Miss South Africa. Yo, 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 yo. She posted a status. Oh my god. I, I remember. remember like the scale of my human. <laughs> sure, guys. I was so bad. Hey yeah, guys, don't do that. Yeah, it's bad. Mm-mm. This is nice. Really? This is like the best <laughs> snake ever. Especially with the sauce. It's like the best. So I think we should, we should, we should take them on that conversation that we once had. Yeah, people need to know why those people still sitting together because you see, you're like, okay, no, she's my fave now. But you that day, guys, I was so mad. I think you posted a status. Mm, I did. Yeah, I did. I can't remember precisely what I said, but since while you were the main man, I think you you know. Yeah, what I, I think I in the status it was saying something like, "We understand that she won as Miss South Africa, but." Could you guys stop being so dark? Something like that. No. Mm -mm. Oh, maybe I I'm said, thinking about something different. Mm, I said, I remember now. I said she won, but then I don't think she'll make it to Miss Oh, to Miss Universe. Miss Universe, yeah. Yeah. Mm. First of all, the reason was her body type because mm. I know over there, overseas, they are like like us South Africans who are busy saying, no, pageant queens should be like this or whatever. Mm. Mm. So they were like, they, they were going to perceive her as not being skinny. Mm. Yeah. I understand. Mm -hmm. But no, you also posted a status and you deleted it. Can you what did I say? I think it's what I just said. Something so like that. Like, something that was bashing not dark, people. Babe. No, but it wasn't dark, something. but it was like no. bashing. Yeah, I remember. Oh my gosh. I said. <laughs> it wasn't you. You just reposted like a screenshot. Yeah, hey, yeah, from yeah. Twitter. They said, mm. um, she's ugly. Yes. That's yeah. what they said. They said that she's ugly. Um, people are only voted for her because she has a nice body. Mm. I, uh, I remember that. Yeah, I was. Guys, I was so mad. Like, I was so mad. It got heated up. And then, yeah, I explained to her. Mm. Well, one thing I like about how I responded was as much as I was angry, I educated her. Mm. Like, I didn't just get mad at her to say, no. You're so evil, what not? Another I, thing is, my vendor friend allows me to say such things. I don't know if she allows me, but she just keeps quiet. So I felt mm. like, okay, maybe she understands what I'm saying. And then I realized, Kawa and I no, you don't really understand. And mm. this is what's happened. And it's yeah. a good thing that you put it out there. Or no, this is how you feel. Because yeah. well. my vendor friend would say, um, we say, ah, it's fine. Now it's okay. And then she, it's actually, I think another thing is that, yeah, sometimes it's just like trying to protect your friendship. You don't want to make mm. things weird and all that. So, yeah, I think that's why sometimes we keep quiet. But nah, don't come at me with you don't look venda. <laughs> yay, 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 yay. Me, I will educate you right away. Ask her. <laughs> yeah, so I think one thing about that is that mm. we should educate each other. Mm. Like, we should educate each other because I feel like we come from different backgrounds where we learn different things and then. And, you know, it's we learn every day, like really learn. But every what day. I think we should all also learn every day is that is respect, respect another person yeah. and how they feel. Yeah. You can't go out there and throwing things like, no, I mean, um, 
you should be looking uh, a darker way. or lighter mm. or whatever like <clears throat> what the hell why should i i'm mm. i'm still were you dark when you grew up or you were just like this i was just like this for the rest of my life mm -hmm. and you know what's even worse my sister is light-skinned mm. my mom is light-skinned okay my dad is light-skinned whoa girl what happened to you <laughs> Okay, guys. I took from my grandmother. Oh yeah, from the father's side. Okay, I feel like I, I relate to her just that I didn't look like this. I feel like now I'm a bit lighter mm. because I stay in bloom. The weather changes, but mm. back at home in Vanda, it's very hot. So I used to be like really, really, really dark. I have Vanda friends and some guy friends. Mm -hmm. Not Vanda only, Vanda and Zonga. Mm. So when they go home, yeah, but they, when they come back to bloom, come back dark. Yeah, it's because then it's they hot. told me that the sun is there is. Like, mm. I've never been to the mm. so I don't know how the Sunday is. It's really hard. Mm. It's really hard. So, what I'm saying is, I can relate to the color thing being dark and light skin, even because mm. my mom is like light skinned and mm. she's like a pretty hand. You guys, my mom is so pretty. <laughs> so, people would be like, Why are you dark? Your mom is light skinned. You know, if maybe you could be lighter like your mother, maybe you'd be pretty. They used to say that shit to me. I'm telling you, I'm like, okay, she's not pretty, she just knows how to dress. Hey! I, I literally what? read those kind of comments on her. Very, nice hey! <laughs> you're not pretty, you just know how to dress yourself. I'm telling you, no, you are lying to me. Mm -mm. There are people who, mm? I'm telling you, if only Imagine. she was pretty mm -hmm. or light skinned like her mother, mm -hmm. but my dad is dark, so what are they I got the millennium from him. Okay, no, the thing is, my dad wasn't really in my life, so people I don't, I don't think they knew they him. They knew him, ne? yeah. No, people should know your dad just so they know why are you dark. What the? Let's just say that we're all beautiful, dark skin, light skin, whatsoever. When that's where now, whatever. You know what? Stop pushing the stereotypes on people. Yeah, it's really, really not cute at all. Mm -hmm. Not at all. It's not. I don't know about you, but I feel like that was a very productive talk. Yeah, it sure was because we put something out there where we thought Korean people should know about, mm -hmm. and we're not gonna hide whatever. We're gonna be straight up with it, and it's better because it's from people with experience. Mm -hmm. Yeah, someone who has done it and someone who received it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, um, and I really hope that you guys like this video, and yeah, we're gonna do a part two. So please tune in and don't forget to like, comment, and also subscribe on both our channels. Please do. And Instagram, don't forget to follow us. TikTok, we, we have put made. the handles down. Yeah, we put the handles somewhere. right here on the screen right now. Uh -huh. Yeah, the yes. And don't forget to follow us on TikTok as well. We are on Twitter as well. Yeah, we love you guys so much. Bye. Boom.